Hello guys, in this video I'll be showing you how to build a molecule using the Avogadro chemical program. You can find a free version of uh, Avogadro by going to the webpage and uh, downloading it. So have the installation, you hop on it and it looks like this. So to start, if you want to build a molecule, you can click uh, the draw tool and uh, this option comes up where you can select atoms so when you click click this drop down button you have a series of uh, options for the atoms to select and uh, if you can't find the atom that you want for example assume that we are looking for ion fe we don't have that among the options here so i'll just click order and then the periodic table of elements will comes up will pop up so you will then uh, let's assume that we want to draw a structure of a high ion pentacarbonyl so i just click fe and then i'll uh, after clicking it i'll come to this uh, white page and click fe so after clicking it you have this uh, brown ball which signifies the high ion atom it comes up like this and uh, i can just go ahead now and attach every other atom to this uh, central atom. Since I am interested in a structure where I have uh, five CO uh, molecules coordinated to the high on center, then the first thing I want to do is to put carbon around this ion atom, and I'll be putting five carbon atoms around it. Okay? So now we have five carbon atoms around this ion atom, but for the CO molecules, uh, we should have uh, carbon and oxygen. Right now we are having carbon and three hydrogen atoms around each of them. So we want to change these uh, hydrogen atoms to one oxygen atoms with triple bond between the carbon and the oxygen atom. So to do that, like you see, I have a periodic table already popped up here. I just go ahead and select the oxygen atom. So selecting the oxygen atom, I'll come to this uh, carbon atom, I'm clicking on this carbon atom, and then I'll drag it such that I can create an oxygen atom. Uh, I still have uh, two uh, hydrogen atoms attached to these carbon centers. Those, so to get rid of those hydrogen atoms and to uh, get rid of the hydrogen atom on this uh, oxygen atom, I will need to add multiple bonds. Like we already know from basic chemistry that uh, carbon should have four bonds. So right here, we have four bonds already established on each carbon atom, but uh, we want to get rid of the oxygen, of the hydrogens. So to do that, we need to put two extra bonds between this oxygen and carbon atoms. So to put bond, you can come here and select maybe triple bond and then click. And now you have a, uh, you should have a triple bond or you can just uh, you know it will leave it I usually leave it as just a single bond I'll just uh, click two times so the more the when you click once you had one bond when you click another one time you had one or uh, extra bond so the more you click on the bond the more bonds you had I mean you cannot have more than um, three bonds in this case so that's it so I'm just going to do the same thing for every other uh, carbon atoms. Just drag it, one, two. Now I have three bonds. Do the same thing for this one, and then you just click three times, two times. And you do the same thing for this, you click uh, two times. This is a ridiculously long bonds, and I will show you how to correct for that later on. So two more times. Now, I have the molecule completely drawn and then uh, the atoms, the number of atoms are fine, and uh, it all looks fine, except for the fact that this is not the actual geometry of the ion pentacarbonyl. So in order to get close to the actual geometry of the ion pentacarbonyl, I will need to uh, minimize the energy of this uh, structure to the lowest possible energy. And uh, Avogadro provides you an opportunity to do that. All you need to do is to go to this uh, E um, icon, which signifies energy, and you can see the arrow pointing in the 
downward uh, direction. So this is a form of uh, auto optimization uh, program or tool that allow you to minimize the energy of your structure to be close to the, uh, the true structure. So when you click it, you'll have uh, several options. And I'm gonna close this periodic table because I don't need it anymore. So you have several op options. You have uh, option to choose the force field. So you have the UFF, Chem, GCAM, M94, and uh, the other options. So you can read the Avogadro manual just to have an idea of the most suitable one for you. But for the case of this uh, demonstration, I am not uh, that interested in having the best structure in this case, because I will still need to perform geometry optimization using a more powerful computational program. I just need to have uh, a, a structure that is reasonable in this case. So I'll just leave it as the UFF force field and then uh, leave every other thing as they are um, and then click start. So whenever when I click start, the energy will start to minimize. As you can see that the structure immediately contract and then the bond uh, that were longer before become reduced and now the calculation is kind of done so when you okay, I can just uh, perturb it a little bit just to uh, see how it's responding so you can see that the energy is reducing so this will keep reducing until you reach the lowest possible energy and then the uh, optimization will stop and then we'll have uh, the structure of the ion pentacarbonate so I will uh, wait until this is stop, and then uh, I will show you um, what else you can you need to do. All right, this uh, is uh, finished right now. So we can then uh, choose the arrow button or maybe the finger button, and either one of them. I'll just choose the arrow button and just try to rotate this uh, molecule just to look at how the structure of it is so you can see that uh, it looks good enough to go with so this is the FeCO5 so we have Fe which is ion then CO this is CO and we have five of it attached to these ion centers so this is the structure and uh, this is just the basic way to um, draw a molecule using the Avogadro chemical software. Uh, please, uh, I will be discussing some other important computational uh, calculation uh, using this molecule, and uh, you can subscribe to my channel to take advantage of this because I'll talk about how to perform geometry optimization using the Hawker computational software, and also how to do uh, calculations like uh, TDDFT, CAS SCF, NEPPT2, and other uh, videos. So subscribe to my channel, or you can just uh, look through the collection of video I have right now to see if I already have them uploaded. Thank you, and have a good day.